This is the beautiful city of Citadella. The Cave of Calavera offers a yearly archaeology field school program in Menorca, Spain. In a town of stone walkways and stunning architecture, the museum provided humble accommodations. They also provide transportation to and from the field site. To our left, we see Alba Mazza, co-director of the Underwater Archaeology Program. Equipment preparation is important before each dive. At maximum depths of 25 meters, each dive averages one hour. Due to this, students practice underwater techniques on land before diving in. Here we see our dive site, the Port of Sinicha. This is Pierre Bouchepol, the Assistant Director of the Echo Museum. With 70 dives over the course of a season, Pierre's quite knowledgeable of the port. These PVC grids are used for underwater mapping. Once in place, a compass is used to configure location, and a special plastic fiber paper is used for the drawing. Plumb bobs may be used for the exact positioning of objects in the grid. Mapping is usually done on a 1 to 20 scale, as seen here. Our first technique is called a circular survey. After fixing a point with a stake, a pre-marked rope is tied at the end. While one diver remains to secure the fixed point, the other searches over a 360 degree area. A flag is used to mark any found objects. To locate metal objects, a metal detector may be used. Anchors are common in this port and need to be measured. Our final technique is the linear survey. Divers are positioned every 3 meters over a 16 meter line.
all this in preparation for the highlight of our excavation. The unearthing of a long-lost shipwreck. 